So, uh, so I am going to put this knob on C and A. On this machine, we are having the two knobs. One is for A and one is for C. A stands for ambient. When I am going to take the reading in ambient, the machine shows reading. See here, instantaneously the reading gate changes. Now, remember one thing here, the noise never remains constant. It is instantaneous noise. Okay, that is the basic fundamental idea. So, after some time, if you take a reading, that reading may go wrong. Whatever reading we are going to be observed for a particular instant, that reading is full and final. This is the basic fundamental idea regarding about the measurement. Okay. So suppose if I am going to be shift the knob on C, especially this C, uh, C mode, we are uh, C, uh, C function, we are going to use for a machine. When I am going to be take the noise for any machine, say lead machine, or even though say milling machine, or even though press hammer, in that case I have to put the knob on C mode. Okay, when I am going to put a knob on A board, in that case I am going to measure the noise in ambient condition. For example, if you are going to if you are going to sit here, then if you if, if somebody is interested, what is my noise? So, suppose somebody is going to speak very loudly, we can measure immediately what is the power of intensity of a particular person. Okay, so this is the idea regarding about this uh, type of this uh, say knob. Now, let us come to this here. Here we are having a different different ranges. Suppose for example, if I am going to be <coughs> switch the range, say. 6, uh, 30 decibel to 80 decibel, if the arrow shows that we have to go for a higher order or higher higher level. So immediately I have to press the knob to the middle one so that we are getting an accurate reading. Suppose if I am going to put the knob on the first mode, then it is observed that if the machine is going to show the arrow that we have to go for a higher side. Immediately I am just switching over the knob and I will come, come to the next mode or next range. Then immediately I am going to go for a final range. See here, in the, if you are going to the third range, if the both uh, values are, it may be same or it may be different. Because uh, as I told you, the noise get instantly changes. It is not remain same. Okay? So while shifting, suppose if suppose if the time is get elapsed of one second, even though that reading gate may changes. So such kind of a practice which is get happen in the uh, actual practice. Okay? Now let us come to this. The here that is slow mode. Suppose if, if the if, 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 you are going, if you are going in the outside the campus and if the, there is a very uh, calmness, in that case we have to uh, measure the noise by using a slow response. So these are the ways by which we can measure the noise in the ambient and even though for machine. So this is the idea. Now what is the rule? So as per the rule of the government of Maharashtra, that is a Noise Pollution Act 2000, it is mentioned that, so from uh, if you, uh, how to take a reading, so suppose from machine at a distance of 1 meter we have to take the reading in ambient condition. In that case our knob it must be on C mode. And for ambient, suppose if the function is there, if marriage ceremony is there, somebody is going to uh, start on Dolby and people they are dancing. In that case the government of Maharashtra has mentioned that in the rule that we have to measure the noise at a distance of 10 meter and the intensity of the noise it should not be more than 110 decibel. If there is a noise intensity is more than 110 decibel, the government is going to take any action. So police is, even though police inspector or police people they are having the noise meter, they can immediately come and decide that we are uh, violating the law and we, we may pay the fine. So such kind of a thing which may get occur. Now, while measurement of the noise or these standards which is laid for radial measurement, okay, radially, so at a, from point source, at a distance of 10 meter radially, we can measure the noise. Okay. It is not like that linear measurement, it is not like a rectangular measurement, it is always a radial measurement. So at any direction, in a particular plane, we can measure a noise. So this is the idea regarding about these measurements. Okay. So, uh, so these are the ways by which we can measure the noise. Uh, okay. Now if anybody is having doubts, then you can ask me so how to. Or if suppose if anybody want to come and speak loudly, you can come and you can check the, what is the level of your noise. I am requesting you somebody comes in front of the stage and speak loudly so that we can measure the intensity of the noise. So you can immediately got the idea how much power is now I am having. Please, please anybody comes, I am requesting you.